AstraZeneca is in the news. Uh, many countries are banning the vaccine because of side effects. So I had to look at the chart and this is the weekly chart. You see it's written here weekly. So we see that uh, it started, we have data since uh, October 2006. I did not find the first trade date anyway. It went down to 33.11 and using the gun angles linking the top to the uh, the bottom to the top we got since uh, 2014 it shows us when it was a breakout it shows us that the target should go up till 35,000 so actually went up to 35,019 and since September 20th it is correcting. So if I use the Fibonacci aspect from the low to the top then we can see that it topped on January 421 and it made three candles a fall of three candles, three candles down. That means three weeks down. Now, if I change this to one day, then it is we can narrow the stop to the top of the last, uh, the third candle, which is 34.80. So I can say that because it did not go above 34.80 that was my stop okay and now it trades at 33.13 and you can see that in the pre-market it is even lower so using the Fibonacci uh, tools again we can see that the target is 50, 50, uh, 26, 26. So I will write here target 26 and it also gives me the date when I should look out for any changes on trend. Okay. I can also use the Fibonacci uh, time but they don't give us more than 89 days so that is not very useful but we can already see that on march 24 we should have a, we should have a change in trend oh now they start to send me all kind of alerts here okay so we are short below the last uh, candle which is 33.50 and targeting 26 okay so this is how i would trade it so good luck if you have if you are in this share it is a major short okay it is the the trend lines show us uh, uh, a short, everything show us a short, and now the, the news also. So we are short below 34,000, 3,400. Okay.